Okay, so welcome to the Alastria presentation. Um, my name is Juan Jimenez. I'm the, I'm the uh, CEO of Alastria, which is a, a blockchain consortia built in Spain. Uh, I'm quite present in, uh, in, in Europe, in all what is happening in Europe uh, when it comes to blockchain. Um, what is Alastria? Alastria is one of the largest uh, public permissioned uh, uh, blockchain networks. It's a multi-sector uh, blockchain platform and it's bringing together corporates, SMEs and academia, but also public institutions, governments, uh, for a common purpose, which is the implementation of a decentralized economy. Um, we're neutral in terms of uh, technology. It's a neutral meeting point. It's a trusted, regulatory aligned. Uh, we, we did our efforts of, of advocacy when it came to Mika, and the pilot regime as well, and all the usage of DLT in Europe. And um, it's, it's all about innovation and blockchain development. Our aims is democratizing the access to blockchain, uh, of course. It's also fostering new digital business models, uh, supporting the development of blockchain networks, and gaining new insights uh, into blockchain, uh, leveraging world, real world use cases. For sure, it's about strengthening the public private collaboration, the so called public private collaboration that is happening more and more in the European region. Uh, I add a, at a glance the figures, the KPIs, which are always important, you have to measure them. We are more than 500 members already. When you combine public and private, both corporates and SMEs, as I, as I mentioned, it's 21 nationalities, it's mainly Spanish, but also uh, we have lots of people from Latin America gathering together and bridging the two, the two continents and we get uh, more and more people from different parts of the world. It's 48% built on the small and mid enterprises, so it's quite inclusive when you look at it. It's 22 economic sectors, as I, as I mentioned, it's multi-sectoral, it's not only financial services, it's not only utilities, it's the whole economy itself. 51 public administrations. It's super important to bring the governments with us and, uh, and, and convince them about the, the, the powerful usage of technology, in this case, blockchain. We have more than 14 working groups running at the same time. 600, no, actually 60 use cases working into production. This is not about testing, it's about uh, 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 production now. Uh, from these members that you see over there, 60 of them more than 60 of them are working on top of our net networks, providing the production and serving their clients. And we have two blockchain networks, of course, one of the most important, built on Hyperledger Besu. The competition that we promote, we bring to the ecosystem this green, greenish part here, the infrastructure. Our play is mostly infrastructure play. And uh, we, we put it, uh, uh, it's, it's totally open source, it's open for the, for the, for the public. And uh, our members build the smart contracts on top of the infrastructure we provide. Uh, in some cases, we help them audit the smart contracts, control and, uh, and measure the smart contracts before deploying into production. And in other cases, we help them build their own smart contracts with a toolkit that we put together and is a, is, a, is a benefit that the members get from belonging to Alastria. When you look at the networks, as I mentioned, of course there are public networks, super important, is where the innovation comes from. We, we are close to the, to the public ecosystem as well. There's also public environments. Most of our corporates and, uh, and the members that, that, that work with us, they use pr private networks, but we are believers of this piece in the middle, which is public permissioned networks, and this is what we're promoting, which combines the advantages of public and private, is an open infrastructure. Um, all participants have to be identified. Identity is super important to Alastria. And, uh, but we have a decentralized governance. When you look at it, it behaves a little bit like a DAO, when you look at the, at the, at the networks and its, its uh, procedures. It's about interoperability, uh, compatible with digital identity. The digital identity we provide, we have a protocol, a digital identity protocol called Alastria ID, compliant with EIDAS2, which is the digital identity uh, dossier that the, that, the, um, that the European Union has put together. It's compliant with the current regulations and uh, is operating under certain governance and procedures that we provide to the ecosystem. 
our members can become uh, node holders. There are regular nodes that have a copy of all the information that is in the network. But when they want to get a higher profile, they can, they can run validator networks, validator nodes. So this, we have these two types of nodes in our networks. These are the networks we are operating. Of course, the, 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 we started in 2017, and by 2019, we had around, we deployed our own mainnet, built on Quorum, the JP Morgan uh, protocol that, uh, that they developed and provided to the ecosystem. Is 200 regular nodes already, plus 10 validators. We have our identity model deployed there. Um, it's a very robust and stable network. And um, it's uh, net zero in terms of carbon uh, and uh, in terms of our energy consumption. And we also have the BESU, and that's why we're here. The Hyperledger BESU started uh, later on in 2022. Has already 21 regular nodes, five validators. We have also the Alastra ID deployed there. Um, we are um, contributing to European, European projects. For example, this one called Trublo the truth of blockchain in order to detect fake news and in order to, um, to improve the quality of information that the European citizens consume. And in this particular case, in this European project, what we're, what we're providing to the network is uh, the usage of this hyperledger network itself. There's more than 300 companies in this Trublo project working on top of hyperledger now. Is modern and powerful, and uh, most importantly, is also what Lackchain, which is uh, like a, the twin brother of Alastria, but in Latin America, is using and is totally interoperable with what we have. So Lackchain and Alastria are working in the same protocol, and this is super important for bridging the two continents when it comes to uh, the usage the, the usage of blockchain. Working groups: we have a sectoral of arts and culture. No surprise is where the NFTs and all the things that we're doing happens. Um, most of our members here that are deploying NFTs are part of this sectoral. Real estate, all about uh, tokenizing real estate assets and uh, also lending uh, facilities that, ha that are underneath these real, real estate assets. Financial services is close to our heart. We have most of the banks uh, uh, as members of the Alastria ecosystem and here they can find this network effect, the so-called network effect and of working in the, with digital currencies, with, with payments, and uh, with digital securities use cases. Also, energy and industry 4.0, super important. The tokenization of energy is quite interesting as well. Transport and logistics, traceability, which is the name of a game when it comes to supply chain finance. And health, the way we, we register uh, health data and, and the way we exchange data from public hospitals to private hospitals and the other way around. And we also have commissions, which are super important when it comes to stitching together the whole thing. These are cross topics as identity for sure, but also ESG, mostly the E part, so, so uh, the environmental. The standardization, we're part of the different bodies of a standardization in European Union and also worldwide. Cyber and AI, which are cross emerging technologies that, that make sense in this mesh of emerging technologies as well. So it's a big ecosystem, it's 14 working groups working at the same time, super relevant for our members. Use cases, most of them are about notarization, so registering data in a network to be, to be, you know, to have the data there notarized and available for, for any third party. Also traceability in supply chain finance, food traceability is one of our main use cases, but not only. Identity is very, very important, it's a big one, it's a big topic now in European Union. We're going to enjoy a, a digital identity in Europe in a year time. Uh, and uh, the, the EIDAS too, as I mentioned, provides the opportunity of using decentralized technologies to, uh, to build this new identity and tokenization, tokenization of real-world assets and also intangible assets. So out of these 60 use cases, we have this pie chart and this, and this, uh, this is the distribution. As I mentioned before, we're part of all these international different bodies. Of course, Hyperledger here, very important, but also INATBA, the EU Blockchain Observatory, the EBSI uh, 
program, which is seven, seven projects at, at the European level and perspective, all of them public. Lackchain, we're part of a Lackchain, we're allies of Lackchain. Lackchain has a, a neutral operator in Latin America that serves 27 countries already. The, the, the W3C, which is the uh, normalization body for payments in the internet, is Authen, Senelec, Etsy, and the Blockchain Association Forum, which is based in the UK. So we're part of all the, this whole ecosystem. Of course, pretty attached with what is happening in Europe. Again, we don't want to be, to be only you know, Spanish. We want to play in this 27 member state convoluted architecture. Uh, and we, we contributed with initiatives, with this Alastria ID that is functional now, uh, through all of our, of our contribution in the standardization, and these very projects that are, have been super interesting. This David-19, we're quite proud of it because we, we fought, in our way, the COVID-19 situation, uh, registering the vaccination process on, on top of our networks. So this is mainly it. Uh, hope you liked. If you are interested in knowing more, please visit alastria.io or, wow. <laughs> it's, I'm, I'm done. And, uh, and you, can, you can send an email to become a member to, to member at alastria.io. Alastria is where blockchain happens. Thank you very much.